These tragedies and economic displacement due to soil degradation can be avoided. Agriculture Chemical degradation Physical degradation Aside from reforestation, bench terracing, contour farming, and sloping agricultural land techniques, what are the other technologies commonly used in the field? Concrete walls and barriers. Concrete is naturally rigid. Long after the surface of the barrier becomes rigid enough to hold the soil, concrete continues to harden to the core. Unfortunately, the rigidity of concrete also means that it is inflexible and brittle. A concrete wall can only withstand so much pressure before cracks begin to appear on the surface. The soil is carpeted with layers of plastic linings, containing it in much the same way as concrete. And since plastics are more flexible, they are less prone to break under stress. However, not even plastic shielding can be considered as ideal material. Plastics are known for being non-biodegradable, posing a major ecological hazard. Are there other options aside from plastics and concrete walls to solve soil degradation and erosion? Bioengineering is, uh, is a method of solving um, engineering problems, civil engineering problems using plants. Bioengineering is a breakthrough application which uses living plants. The plants eventually become part of the soil to help bind it together, preventing erosion. It also helps in controlling sediment buildup, enabling plants and animals to flourish in harsh conditions. Bioengineering combines biological, ecological, and engineering concepts for efficient soil management techniques. Nadidiscover ng mga ano, mga engineers na mas magaling pa rin yung mga tanim na ilagay na lang. Recently, na-revive yung bioengineering na pinunakis ng mga ninuno natin. Yung mga una nag-revive noon yung mga Dutch, mga Germans na masyado silang concern sa environment. Tapos, uh, recently, mga Japanese, Koreans, mga Americans, parang bumabalik na tayo ulit sa nature. Bioengineering is already being used in industrialized countries such as the United States, Japan, and Germany. It is also best suited for mountainous terrain in the Philippines. Compared to conventional soil curing methods, bioengineering offers several advantages. All natural, cost efficient, safe, visually blends with environment. The arrival of bioengineering provides an opportunity for marginalized rural Filipinos to have an additional source of income. For instance, bioengineering related projects have emerged in various parts of the country. These communities produces the cocoa fiber and geotextiles that are used in bioengineering. They are organized into cooperatives and community-based work groups to respond to the growing demand for geotextiles. Behind these success stories in engineering and enterprise creation is Coco Technologies Corporation, a product of Filipino resourcefulness and ingenuity. Coco Tech tests, manufactures, and markets its own line of bioengineering products for use in the country and overseas. Coco Tech is committed not only towards environmental preservation, but also the economic upliftment of rural communities in the Philippines. Soil degradation is a worldwide environmental concern due to its toll on nature, the economy, and human lives. Bioengineering is a solution. It is an effective response to the threat of soil degradation. It helps protect the environment. It saves cost in engineering works. Bioengineering, too, leads to the growth of enterprises and livelihood in rural communities in the Philippines.